Jeremiah 41. Now Babylon has captured Jerusalem and the Babylonians are controlling the land of Judah. And they make Gedaliah the ruler of, of Judah. But there's a guy called Ishmael who's a relative of the royal family. And he clearly was planning a kind of revolt to get the throne back to him. There's a difficult relationship between him and Gedaliah. And actually Ishmael kills Gedaliah in the end. But Gedaliah accepts Ishmael and we're told they ate bread together in Mizpah. To eat bread together, to break your bread with someone, was a sign of acceptance. That's the point here. Now, the Lord Jesus broke his bread. He ate together with all kinds of sinners, with prostitutes, with, with tax collectors and all, all kinds of people. And the Jews, of course, didn't like it. They said, why? Why is he eating? Why is he sharing his bread with sinful people? And Jesus replied, he said, I'm a doctor and I came to lead the sinners to repentance. I'm a doctor who came to cure the sick, not to help the people who think they're healthy. So, you see that Jesus then accepts us at his table, whoever you are, in order to lead you to repentance. He doesn't say, well, you get your act in order up to a certain level, you jump some hoops, then you can come to my table. <laughs> my table is open. Please come and eat with me. And it is that experience of radical grace and acceptance which will elicit in us repentance. And so it is that openness of Jesus to you and me that he is not demanding, as it were. He just says, look, I love you. I want you to fellowship with me. Would you please come and eat with me? You're a prostitute. You're this, you're that. Please come. Please come. It's that experience of his acceptance which makes us repent. That's why Jesus has this open attitude, because it naturally elicits repentance. Now, all this won't work if you don't think you're a big sinner. You've got to be convicted of your sin. And then you will see the wonder of being invited to the communion table of the perfect sinless Son of God. And it will elicit a huge change in you.